Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at Halo Wars 2 running on Intel HD 620 graphics. I'd previously tested the beta version of this game with some older drivers, and I was uh, let know by someone who actually works for Intel um, who, that the release version, or the final release of this game, and the later Intel drivers fixed the um, rendering issues I'd seen with the title, and they very kindly sent me a code for the game, which I'm testing out today. And as we can see here, unlike when I originally tested the title, all of those rendering artifacts that were originally present appear to have gone. And actually performance isn't bad. Um, we're running this at 1366 by 768 and the minimum detail settings. But we can see frame rates are pretty smooth on this. Um, I don't really have a great idea of how to play the game. Just loaded it up just to test to see if things had improved. And yeah, uh, these settings, the game definitely appears to be in a playable state. Uh, we aren't seeing the sort of severe graphical glitching. Um, so if you've got Intel HD graphics, particularly some of the more modern chips like HD 520 or 620 um, based products, you're going to be able to run the title without issues so long as you make sure that you have grabbed the latest drivers uh, and are running the release version of the game as you probably should be if you've got it through the Windows Store. So I hope you found this interesting, um, always happy to update a title when I've heard that things have, issues have been fixed and it's great to see that compatibility and performance is up there on this now. I hope you found this video useful. If you'd like to see more from us in the future, be sure to hit the subscribe button. We've got plenty more videos we're sure you'll enjoy as well, looking at gaming on other platforms. Thanks for watching.